I just came to the conclusion that no matter what I do, it's always something. You know what I mean? Yeah, I get that. I just think people are, you know, people talk shit, and I get it, like, because they see you, and they see you online asking for money. Thank you. But I'm like, not. I, I, I mean, I, I, I was an addict, and I've been clean for um, almost two years now, and, you know, so I get it. I totally fucking get it. And I'm not saying that you are, you know what I mean? Like, I've been on methadone and shit like that, and I'm on Suboxone, so, like, I fucking get it, you know? Shit's fucking hard. I, I, it is. It's very hard. Oh, wait, wait, I see Abby. All right, girl, I'll let you go, so, like, you seem like you're doing better, but have a good day. You too, honey. Thank you. Okay, bye. If I can get Abby in here, I can find out where they are. What's the point of this live? Um, Abby needs to stay away from me. Stop it, Jay-Z boo-boo. Yeah, Abby's my daughter. If she doesn't get her butt up in here, I'm going to be mad at her. Why are you in there? Huh? Hmm? Because she told me to. Yes, she did. You want to stay out here, baby? You want to go back in? I thought she was done. Who cares if I'm done or not? Um, there is playgrounds around here, but they're not safe. You want to take the rest of the garbage out that we got together? Give me a smoke real quick. No. They're on the the how you come in and get yourself. I'm getting mad. 
Why the F did she ask me to get on here and then do this? Walk up to the park with me, no. please. Abby is coming. She's in the bathroom. She messaged me. Everybody's like proud of him, proud of him. He's disrespecting his mom. Go Jays. Thank you for the gift, Claire. Where's my lighters out? Oh, fucking no, bro. Far from a parent. Girl, I've been raising kids since I was 15 years old. Abby has five seconds and then I'm hanging up. My oldest is 21. There she is. Yes. Hey. Hello. So they're asking me all kind of questions about you. Do you please want to answer? Please don't send me like, a bunch of gifts, guys, please. Why? Let them send you the gifts. Because I don't need the gifts. I know you don't. Why did I beat my mom up? Because we were having an argument and I thought she was coming at me first. So I reacted in one swift movement. A Abby, since we're not in the same house, why don't you explain to these people the dynamic between me and you? 
What do you mean? How you said we bicker and we whatever, but two minutes later we're fine. Yeah, I mean, we bicker and we argue just like every other family does. There's real fights and then there's bickering and there's that. They just don't seem to understand that we just want to be left alone, Ab. Well, I know I want to be left alone. You shouldn't have jumped up in it in the first place. Um, I really didn't. When you're on live and there's millions of people watching you, Mom, and they find out you got kids, they found me. And I'm not going to just have everyone spamming my phone, asking me questions and stuff, making it seem like I'm in on whatever the fuck's going on. So Why? I'm going to come out and say that I'm not doing this stuff. Nikki did it. Colbert did it. Because they don't live with you. They're not around you. They're not directly involved, really. But they know more about me than Jesse and Ronnie do. That's for damn sure. Okay, and that's Jesse and Ronnie's decision that they got up on here. Mm. I got up on here because I am directly involved with you. People started asking me things, messaging me, blowing me up, found my socials. So I wasn't just going to sit there and let people keep doing that stuff. I ignore him, Abby. That's what you should do. I've told you that a hundred times. Well, and everyone's not the same person. Why am I doing this on social media? Because uh, I want to. How's that for an answer? Look, now they're tagging tech. Didn't I tell you earlier I'm a grown woman? Abby, why don't you like tech again? Can you explain that to me again? I don't like tech. I don't like Michelle. I don't like none of them that hopped on there. I believe that all of them are just in this for attention. Come on whenever it's big, comes on, does that, and then disappears for a while. And then this cycle, like this is just a cycle. This is a rinse and repeat cycle that just needs to stop, literally. Well... Tech, tech does check on me when I'm not online. Well, then that's tech. I, I, I have my opinion of her. I don't know. I don't speak to her. I just see what I see, and I have an opinion about it. Well, this whole thing started because somebody called you a crackhead prostitute. I'm not letting that fly. Okay, well, stuff like that I don't care about. People are going to assume that I'm also on drugs because you're my mom. But I watched you and dad completely destroy your life with drugs. And I would never take myself down that path also. That's one thing. Okay, Abby. Yeah, you're right. You're you're the great one. I'm not saying I'm the great one. I'm not saying I'm golden. I'm not saying I'm perfect. No, everybody is perfect on here but me. Like, I'm not saying that. I Everyone else can say that, but I'm not saying that. Literally, nobody is perfect. 
Well, you never get on here and tell them how much I've done for you or just all of it, Abby. Because why do I need to get on here and say those things? That's, that's, that's what you don't understand is there could be lives like that. There could be lives where we just talk and do things like that. But every time you get on here or it does something, it becomes a big thing. It's either like a, you're on there crying, begging for money, or it's like a, there's like 37 people in box and it's fucking Lisa intervention time. We could get on and just be like at the park. Chilling, talking, doing things, but it, no, it's always one or the other, and it's a rinse and repeat cycle, like I said. Okay, well, when you hit me and all that, do I make um, you leave? Um, that day, I don't, yeah, that day actually you did kick me out, and you said I wasn't allowed to come back, but that night you did let me back in. During the day, you did kick me out. You did, but that night you did let me back in. Mm -hmm. What about this last time? That's what I'm talking about. You didn't go anywhere this last time. I left with Pap and you stayed here. No, you left with Pap. I was still in the house. You called me. You said, by the time I get back, I want you out. So I went out and I was in the hallway all day and then I came back at nighttime and you said, you're not allowed in here unless you apologize for my door. And yeah. then I apologize for your door. Like that's, I don't, I don't know what else you want me to say. That's literally what happened. Okay. Like, I'm not saying, no, you didn't fully kick me out. Yes, you did let me back in. I would never kick you out. You're my daughter. I had to apologize for her door because when we were fighting the day before, I busted her door up. People are asking, why Why did I really kick in your door? You want to tell them? Because you saw the comments saying that I said that the lipo was paid for. That's literally why you came kicking down my fucking door. Mm. And who was in there when I kicked that door open? Me. Oh. Well. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, Abby. Well, I love you. Um, They they don't believe me, so I was hoping you'd give some truth. It's fine. I understand. Um, you there? Yeah, I don't. I don't know what you want me to say. 
No, oh, Abby, there's nothing you can say. I eat a fucking baby bottle pop. I'm huffing blue paint. I wake up. I got, I guess, white stuff around my mouth. I, I don't know what that was now. It's, I'm always doing something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not you. I can only, I can only say what I be doing. Yeah. I know you've never have pain. I don't. You've done plenty of things, but I've never seen you have no pain. That's what I can say. Mm. Like. And what's the plenty of things you've seen me do? I mean, I don't think all of it needs to be aired on the internet. That's happened over the past years on years that I've been alive and you've been my mother. Yeah, give me one second. Yeah. Now. Thanks. It's okay, buddy. Don't worry about it. I'm laughing at the Jace comments. Well, I, I don't find it very funny. You don't find it funny that Jace is funny? I don't, I don't know what else to say here. Well, the poor kid don't have anybody but me. I, he don't have nobody but you. Where am I? Where am I? Who, who took him trick or treating? Who made sure he had his Halloween costume? I know that you offered to get him one, <laughs> and he didn't want one. Don't go there. But when it came down to it, and it was the time and he decided he wanted one last minute, I made sure he had one. So I do. I do just as much for Jace. No, Jace doesn't have a lot of people in the family at all. None of us do. We have the shittiest family in the world. I know. Period, point blank. But you're not the only one there for Jace. I do so much for him, and I will argue with you about that because I have, since I've been old enough and had my own place done things, done as much as I can for him. I want to know who was in your fucking room. Jace was in there. Jace was in there, and I have a video of it. If it's going to cause a problem, I don't want to cause a problem.
Chase is 11. I didn't mute Abby. Abby muted herself. She's probably fighting with Doug now. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know that. I didn't know. Doug is Abby's boyfriend. I'm causing problems. She called me and asked me to do this. Y'all are all Kay. Kay, I have to get off now. You're thanks, all... Mom. Thanks. 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 You're Glad all... I went on here for you. I'm going to fucking kill myself. I'm saying this publicly live. Goodbye. Okay. I got to call Pap. He's going to beat up Abby. I didn't even know that he could hear us. Thanks to me. Oh my God. She called me and told me. It's not what I wanted. I want my daughter to get beat up. 